Understanding, receive the medal, a guide for English learners. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning channel. Today, we're going to explore the phrase, receive the medal. This phrase might seem straightforward, but it's packed with cultural and linguistic nuances that are essential for English learners to understand. So, let's dive in and unravel its meaning together. Receive the medal is a phrase that combines two key components, receive and the medal. Receive, this verb is all about getting or being given something. In English, it often implies that someone is on the receiving end of an action or item. The medal, medals are typically small, flat pieces of metal, often shaped like a coin, that are awarded to honor achievement. They can be related to military, academic, sports, or other fields of excellence. In this section, we will explore both these elements in detail to understand how they come together in this phrase. Medals are not just physical objects. They carry a lot of symbolic weight. They represent recognition, honor, and achievement. Understanding this context is crucial when interpreting the phrase. Different fields. We'll look at how receiving a medal can mean different things in sports, academics, the military, and other areas. Ceremonial aspect. Often, receiving a medal is part of a formal ceremony or event, which adds to its significance. This section will help viewers understand the deeper meaning behind receiving a medal in various contexts. Here, we will explore how to use, receive the medal in everyday English. Formal and informal use. We'll discuss when it's appropriate to use this phrase in both formal and informal settings. Variations of the phrase. Learn about similar phrases like, awarded a medal, or honored with a medal, and when to use them. This practical application will help learners feel more confident in using the phrase in real life situations. Thank you for joining us in this exploration of, receive the medal. We hope this video has not only helped you understand the phrase but also the cultural richness it embodies. Keep practicing, and soon, you'll be using English phrases like a pro. See you in our next video.